I brought with me another one of a material that is uh, used in the food industry. And um, red dye number 40 is an ingredient that is used in many, many food applications. Cereals, drink mixes, you name it. Red dye number 40 you'll see on the label of most products that you see in the grocery store. And in this application, we have a customer in Ohio that wanted to create a more free-flowing finished product. So we took the fine powder. This is about a 325 mesh uh, red dye powder. And we put that in the Rolla mixer and simply sprayed water onto the powder to create this minor granule finished product. And you know, it's really important when you're spraying liquids onto powders because you have to respect the droplet size in relationship to the particle size so that you can achieve that finished desired finished product. Now, a dry fog is like 2 to 10 micron, and a wet fog is like 10 to 50 micron. And then you get into a mist, and when you get over 100 micron, you get into droplets. So it's really important. In this case, we are spraying on about a 30 micron droplet size onto a powder that's about 20 micron, and we're able to roll it up and make a real fine, free-flowing finished granule.